it can be a long day, so we have uh, two or three guys around. Bryce, the kids are around. Madison does the books. Bryce helps with the AI and Riley helps bring them up. Uh, that's it's a full day. Uh, everybody, I try to keep everybody calm and nobody hurt. That's the biggest thing. So. Mm. On Robert's herd here, we usually start and do the pre-breeding shots uh, 30 days ahead on the cows. Uh, we'll put cedars in the heifers using the 14-day cedar protocol. Um, so we'll run the heifers through, put the cedars in, give them their breeding shots, and usually that same day we uh, run all the cows through and give the pre-breeding shots that day as well. Two weeks later, uh, we pull the cedars on the heifers. 16 days after that, we would uh, give them the prostaglandin shot. And um, a week ahead of that is when we'll bring cows back through and start them on the seven days cedar protocol. So we are giving prostaglandin shots to the heifers and pulling cedars and giving prostaglandin shots to the cows on the same day. The day that we uh, give the prostaglandin shot to the heifers and pull the cedars on the cows, we bring the breeding barn and we get it set up that evening when we're done working the cattle and uh, we'll heat check for estrus and we'll breed as they cycle and um, we have a two stall breeding barn which we run the cattle through when we are AIing. We'll also put estra tech heat patches on them. We'll observe heats and we'll pull and breed on estrus. On the third day we'll just run everything through and finish up with a time breed at the end. Two days after we do our time day I, we turn out a cleanup bowl. We pull him about 14 days later, repatch all the cows, and we'll check heats for anywhere from eight to 10 days and uh, rebreed anything that comes in heat. Um, then we'll turn the bowl back out. And by doing this, Robert can run one cleanup bowl on 240 cows. We do turn out, the last two years we had used a uh, Charlotte bull and uh, last year and this year we're going to use a, a Hereford bull and we do this so we can tell the AI calves from the uh, bull bred calves.